the answer to that's not long. It's short legs. Yeah. But then it has got beyond visual range capability, so but so is a typhoon. Yeah, the trouble with BVR is under modern warfare we've never used it. Yeah. We've always got to um always got to be in range, visual yeah, you, range. You got ID. Yeah. Sounds a bit of a waste of that capability, I'm afraid. Yeah, a little bit. Russians don't care, they just fire. Oh. Give us a one taxing out at Ascension. From my one three. How far out are you? Uh, two hundred and ninety miles. Cool. What's your what's the radio? Uh, I am heading two two four, but I'm on a tanker, so we're sort of wandering about a bit. Ah, okay. So once you finish tanking, can you give me your inbound radio, yep. and I'll just take yep. away one at you. I'll use the VOR. Ah, uh, just gone into cloud. Where's my tanker? Oh no. <laughs> I know roughly where you're going to be anyway, because of the route. So I'll launch and start heading. Yeah, there. exactly. Ascension's so much smaller than than I remember. <laughs> I suppose yeah, it does I'm, look it. It's smaller when you fly in at 200 knots. I suppose it is only six miles wide in real life, so. You never had the pleasure, did you, of coming here? Uh, only an overnight. Oh, okay. That's all you need. <laughs> yeah, I saw pretty much everything. What do you reckon breaking the uh, speed of sound rules would be here? Yeah, you're alright, you're o over the sea. Just get far enough out before I go. About zero six zero. I started on ferry flights with the F thirty five. I do a tank at thirty thousand feet on the climb. Yeah, yeah. Just as a top up, because you burn what two thousand pounds quite easily. Get into that. Anchor in myself, 30,000 feet. That didn't take me long. Gear up at 31 and cruising at 33 took me two minutes. Can't really complain at that. Not bad. I am only full air to air fit though. With Well, I've got, no, I've got externals as well, I suppose. Not exactly light. Nice and smooth up here, though. Eh? 
burnt three and a half thousand pounds getting there though. Yeah, that's the trouble. Well, it doesn't matter if you've got a tanker up above no, exactly. you. Exactly, a couple of minutes on this and then I'm good. Nothing to see but seal round. Yeah, it's a very boring trip. Yeah. The weather's pretty consistent here though, so it's a good place to do an exercise like it. Yeah, Tom's got a new job if you haven't seen, so he'll be flying, he'll be making the commitment better. Oh yeah, he did seem to be on a bit more, didn't he? He's not started his new job yet for two weeks, but he's got it's a more consistent app. Yeah. Because at the minute he works in Waitrose. And it's just he's in and out all sorts. You still on Zach? Uh, no, just finished messing around with that. Cool. If you let me know your inbound radio. I'm just finishing up here now. Disconnecting from mine. What head in you inbound? Uh, just coming back onto track. Let's just check that stupid GPS. Um, so it will be two three two, I think. Yeah, it should be right about two three two. So if I go outbound on zero five zero. Uh, if you go outbound on zero. Zero six, zero six five, something like that. If I'm on two four two, say two you'll four be two. zero. I'll be two four two, so you'll oh, okay. be zero six two. Oh yeah. Yeah, zero six two. I'll go zero six zero. Yeah, should do it. I'll do it. Yeah, I'll go outbound on that. Pick up that radio. What height are you at? Uh, 
Uh, I'm going back up to 320, I'm not going to go anymore because I've got it's not worth it. Cool, I'll be at 300. Actually, I'll be at 310, opposite direction. I'm quite pleased with that tanking mod to the Typhoon, works really well. Yeah. Refuels at the same rate as the um, F-35, so... Yeah, it's good. Same rate, but I think it carries a lot less fuel. Or does it carry about the same? I can't remember. What, the Typhoon? Yeah, in real life, obviously, oh. obviously it carries more. Carries tons, yeah. It's got quite... It's got about three, three and a bit hours on full when you get to cruise. And uh, it's just, just you'd be on vapors if you didn't top up on the way to the ascension. So, but um, it's got if you put the fuel page up, it's got a very nice um, totalizer thing you can see. So when you're tanking, you can see it going up. Yes. Yeah, it's very good. Can't wait for D nice to come out. No, that would be smart, wouldn't it? Yeah, I presume um, Ryan and whatnot have done their air to air, so they know what they're doing. No, they haven't done any tap back at all. So at the minute, they are just dead targets to it. Oh, so Ryan said he was going to take out a typhoon to the ascension. He won't be able to do that last leg. Oh, yeah. That's it. Well, oh, is it not going to make it even at a push? Well. I suppose if he's really economical, he might just make it, and it will be only just. Let's see how he goes. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're all qualified to fly, but not tap back. I'm heading 090 to get onto the radial 060 outbound, 46 miles at the moment. There you go, I'm just coming onto the radial. Got a couple of people watching us. Oh, watching me. Got you on my TSD now. Just crossing the 100, huh. 120 mile mark. Okay. Uh, I've brought up my radar, but it doesn't go that far. Yeah. Bloody aircraft's gone past the radio, it's turning back to get onto it. <laughs> Don't really need it that much now, though. I've got a heading I can use. What are you, about 150 miles out? 184. 
speed you cruising at? Uh, 300 indicated. Cool. Yeah, that's about what I can get to without using afterburner at this height. Yeah, there's plenty of power in this, of course, but about Mac 0.8182 at 32,000 seems to be uh, seems to be okay. Oh, okay. I thought I would have thought you'd gone higher. I usually, yeah, I usually go much higher than that. But. I went up to 34, and then um, it seemed to be that seemed to be okay for economy. I didn't try it any more than that. So. Okay. You serve you service still in 65, so you got plenty of headroom there. Yeah, yeah. It's just how much fuel you consume to maintain yeah. a decent speed. That's all. Yeah. I think 0 0.9 at 40,000 is is maintainable, but then it's. Mm. I mean, it's okay. You can just that's just drop down to yeah. a tanker. That's usually where I hang around, 40,000 or above at 0 0.9. Yeah. You might get bleeps, I've got air-to-air -air mode on. Ah, okay. Might I might get... reciprocate then. Yeah. <laughs> you, might get track... you might get a tracking warning. <laughs> Just seeing how far it picks you up. Just interested to see how far I can see off on this radar. Got it zoomed out to 80. But I don't mean that much. Loft mode, that's when it uh, it just shoots massively high and then comes down on target, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know what's better, loft or non-loft, really. Oh, someone's it asking depends. for an external. There's your external view. I'm streaming at 1080, but I can see it at 4K. just can't stream at 4K. Because Twitch doesn't want it. Sorry, carry on. I was just talking to my followers. Yeah, what's better, loft or non-loft? Well, it depends on the depends on the target and whether you're um, uh, look down, shoot down, or whether you're going to fire the um, anti-radiation missiles because mm. they they climb and then loiter for a bit, so there'll be a loft. Uh, but for the aim one twenty, that's what I'm wondering. Uh, no, you don't want them to loft really, just no, straight. It's a waste of time, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry, I'm not planning to shoot you. <laughs> uh, got you crossing 60 miles. Figured out how to um, stream my Plan G. It's just as an extra window in the top right corner of a stream. So people can see. Oh, oh right, I might. Like... Plan G. Yeah. Just figured out how I can do multiple windows so I could display my team speak I could display TFR if I wanted there's no uh, while, I'm, while I'm playing this there's nothing really other than plan G that anyone needs to see yeah so you're at 32 you say yeah right, and I'm at 31 yeah. I've got a heading for you now just coming up to 40 miles still haven't picked you up on my uh, search radar it's weird even if I go armed nothing yeah you're not on mine yet are there About, by the time I hit you, we've got about 100 miles left. Still not got you. This is quite weird, considering you're inside 40 miles now. Yeah, 
No, I haven't seen. I haven't seen you. Uh, you just oh my word! Gosh, that was low. What's that? Puma, Puma whistling by at rooftop height. Oh, oh, there we go. Forty miles is when I pick you up. Ah, gotcha. Yep, gotcha. Just gonna see when it tells me to shoot head on. Should be at about what thirty miles, maybe twenty-five. Should be quite far because we're head on. Because that's what it takes into account, doesn't it? Closer speed. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. We're closing at nearly a thousand. Is that feet per second? Was that knots? Uh, that would be closing speed in knots. Ah. I'll maintain this heading, I can uh, see you coming down the left hand side. Yeah. 20 fine. miles away, yeah. Still not getting a shoot queue, it's really weird. Yeah, I haven't got one yet. You got 120s or 9s? 120s, I've got aim 9s as well. Hmm. I'll just switch to sidewinders. It's 13 miles, Jesus, I mean, I should have been able to get you ages ago. Miles, there you go. Eleven, just about ten and a half miles. I got a shoot kit. I've got a steering dot, and shoot. Yeah, I've got a shoot yeah. cue from a sidewinder. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was an aim 120. I was looking at though. Should have a more range than that. But oh right, let me check my aim 120s then. Aim 120 wouldn't give me a shoot cue until about ten miles on it. I'm gonna deselect you as a target. Deselect them. Um, uh, well, actually, no, I'm not. Yeah, I am. Oh uh, yeah, you're too close for the uh Yeah. Turn into join. Right. Speed you up. Uh three hundred indicated. Go ahead. Should have turned about five miles before I got to you. <laughs> well, that's good visibility. I can see Azzy from here, 119 miles away. Yeah, it's not bad, is it? Yeah, I'm closing. Fuel trickle away. It's fine. I've got fourteen thousand pounds still. Done quite well, considering I've been in the air thirty minutes. So in total, I've burned about th about eight thousand. Can't see you yet. Four point three miles behind you now. 
closing quite fast now then. Yeah, yeah, I can see a little dot, that's it. Ah, okay. Closing up 175 knots, increasing. When you descend them? <laughs> yeah, I'll wait till you form eight and then we'll uh, probably well, start. I can catch you on the descent. If you, uh, do you just fly it's, as you need? Uh, I'll, I'll just fly to you. Two okay, go. what have I got? I've got under 100 miles, so I ought to think about it. So. I'm only two miles from you now, closing about 0.1 a second. Have you visual now as well? Yeah, I can see you. Do the old engine cut, or else I know it will be throttling too high. Point nine. Yep, I can see it. Just descending now, anyway. You're indicated three zero five. Copy. Move it up left. That's the screenshots grabbed anyway. Nice. Definitely time for a run and break today. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. Nice and low down the uh, runway, and then right once we pass the terrain on the right. Yeah, yeah. RWK981, oh yeah, I can't talk right now, <laughs> I'm uh, concentrating too much, enjoy. You following the arrival or are you going for visual? Uh gonna get a bit closer and then I'll just um go visual anyway and just cool. uh fly around the right hand side of the island. Cool. 
Oh, I can tell we're getting lower. My air brakes do something now. Yeah. Oh, where are you gone? Did you just change view? Oh. No. No, you just jumped ahead or I jumped back, one of the two. Alright. Alright, where are you gone? Whereabouts are you in relation to me? Underneath you and now in front. Cool, I'll reposition. How are you at? Uh, 21,300. There you are, got you. Bit of weird, weird server jitter. Yeah. Pull me back up. Speed you up. Uh, three one nine. Be on your right. Roger. On your right. <laughs> yep, gotcha. Just heading for the right of the island now. Roger. Bringing the speed back. I don't know where the landing lights are in this thing. Uh, thumb switch. Right where your thumb would be on the... Um Ah, I've hidden the yoke, that's why. Ah. Yeah, give it some flares on the uh, on the brake. Yeah. Good do. That's what we always do. Looks good. A little tactical. I'll just, uh, I'll just test them now then. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll just, I don't know which side the. There you go, I'm above, so it should be alright. I'll just see him. You tried him? Yeah, they should have gone. No, I didn't see any. Try again. Nope, not seeing any. Oh. How's it coming with the uh, one-time installation for file? Putting everything in one so we can uh, just give it out. 
Uh, yeah, I thought I'd done one actually. I'll have to check. Oh. Oh, okay. We haven't seen it yet. I think I've got. Oh. I think I've got most things installed. Actually, no. I'd, oh, I know you've jumped. Bugger. Where are you? Are you somewhere there? How are you at? Nine thousand two. Where there you are. Just gonna pop the speed brake out too fast. Is it out? Can't see it out. Yeah, it is. Oh well, yeah. Can see the effect. Speed you out? Uh, two fifty now. Ah, something wrong with that engine. It's not idling. Might have to do the old cut the engine. Might just take a little while because it's been such been high high RPM for so long. Maybe. No flight sim does that. Cut it. No, I think I might have to, you know. Go on then. I don't understand. Yes, oh, no. same, N same thing. My N1 is 14%, it? so why is it um, increasing speed? Or is that speed now finally coming back? Might just take a little while. Slick bastard. Yeah, stick the speed brake out again. Is it, up, is it happening? Is it? Seems like it. Speed's coming down, but the speed break out, so I'll just pop it away again. Fancy. Yeah, it's like it's like the auto throttle's still stuck, stuck on. They're definitely off. Yeah, as far as I know, it says it's off. Just do an engine restart. You know, like you have to do in the F thirty five, it might be the same sort of issue. Cause it's Let me know what your plan is. Um, well, I'll go for a running brake anyway, but uh, can't even shut the engine down. Mm, maybe the uh, maybe on the brake it'll wind yeah. itself down. Ready to turn in when you're up. What speed you at? Uh, 322, so that's not bad. You turning in? Yep. Gonna lose it in that cloud, aren't we? I ain't got a cloud, I got complete clear weather. Use an active sky. Got a VOR tuned in. Yeah, the RWR's on. No, the VOR. Oh, VOR. No, I haven't got it tuned in. If you want it, it's 122. No, sorry, 112.20. Yeah, it should be alright.
Running brake at about uh, 500 AGL. Uh, yeah. Why does yours keep skipping? Weird, isn't it? Uh. You used to happen with view changes or something, or if you've had a, maybe you're having a little frame lag all of a sudden, I don't know. Yeah, 500 AGL is good. I got visual on the airfield. What speed are you going in at? Trying to get 300, but it's 350 now. Okay. We'll survive. No one else for miles around. Got to try and land at this speed, though. I hope it pulls it out of it in the break, maybe. <laughs> Try and lose enough speed to be like almost no air going in, sort of thing. God, it's increasing. It's 370 knots now. What the hell? I wonder what the uh, keyboard shortcut is for uh, auto throttle. Is the auto throttle showing? On or off on the right hand side? No, it's showing off. Oh. You might have to do an engine shutdown on the, on the downwind leg and then restart it maybe. Yeah, I might extend the downwind leg just to get it all sorted out. Force it to spool down. Yeah. Because the one's ready. 500 feet. And on the brake. One's break. Pull up, pull up. I'm going to have quite a small circuit, so one's downwind now. Gear down. Have you visual? I'm uh, over the coast. Short. I'm going to be doing quite a short final. Yeah, that sorted out the uh, throng. What was that? That uh, brake sorted out the throng. Yeah, it might just be that it's struggling to spool down until you've sort of yanked it out of it with low speed and stuff. Have you visual? I'll just turn the short finals. Oh, I'm going to try and vacate um, to the right rather than having to go to the turnaround. Yours is the that'll be the first typhoon to arrive that. Yeah, I think so. You'll find out if the runway's long enough to stop for you. Well wrong. Oh, it's a little bit harder than usual. Obviously. Roger. Uh, I've just gone past it, but I should be able to backtrack unless you're right on finals now. No, I've just done an S to give you some room. Cool, backtracking. Give me 10 seconds to VK. Yeah, it's deceiving because um, the terrain is uh, it's sort of uphill just before you get to the runway. Um, oh, the flare, I'm doing slightly late. So 570 feet per minute, that. Not broken, but not the best. Are you uh, clean? Okay. Yeah, vacated. Oh, roger. Have you? 
you going around? Nah, just gonna land long. Scrub oh. off some of that speed. Ah, okay. Fifty-minute flight, my hope. Back in a minute. Have you got scenery installed? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know if you do. What you got on your left there? Uh, fire station. That's weird. I'm just taxiing along the TriStar track. Yeah, you're on the, um... You're above the ground for me. You're hovering. <laughs> just press F for me. I don't know, I don't know if I'll actually drop a flare for you, but... I wonder if I've got something that's correcting my terrain when it doesn't need to be. Oh, yeah, I do. Great. Ah, so you're probably parked underground then. Yeah, I'm just refreshing my data now. It'll put me, I'll, it'll be right then. I'll just. Well, we're now on the correct level, but something's... I'm going to have to undo what I've just done. 